Hi, it's Andy for Digital Trends and I'm still at Mobile World Congress in Barcelona. It's the second day, but don't think the excitement has stopped because we've got some footage of Jolla's new Sailfish OS, the Oppo N1 camera phone and HTC's new Desire 816. So let's go. Sadly, HTC hasn't brought a new flagship Android phone to MWC, but instead it has launched the Desire 816. The Desire name usually means mid-range. The 816 still manages to pack in a 5.5 inch 720p screen, a quad core Snapdragon processor, a 13 megapixel rear camera, and a 5 megapixel front camera. Doesn't sound all that mid range to us. The phone also sports a new look for the desire range, and the sleek 8mm thick body shell looks great. Finnish mobile upstart Jolla, or Yolla as it's more accurately known, is showing off its first smartphone at Mobile World Congress, which means we got to spend some time with it and the Sailfish OS software. The silky smooth gesture based operating system is good looking and different enough to stand out. We even caught a glimpse of it running on a Nexus 4 and a Nexus 7. And the good news is, Yolo will soon release the software for us to install on our own Android phones. If you thought the latest 5 megapixel front facing camera sounded cool, how about one with 13 megapixels? That's what you get with the Oppo N1, a smartphone with the world's first rotating camera lens. So the rear camera is also your front camera. It's not the only impressive thing about the N1 either. It has a clever touch sensitive rear panel to make navigating the massive 5.9 inch screen just that bit easier on the finger. Well that's another long day at Mobile World Congress all done. But we'll be back again tomorrow for more video coverage from the event and make sure you check digitaltrends.com for the best and latest coverage of all the coolest gadgets in Barcelona.